should start. Today we're going to talk yeah, about the engineering notebook. The first thing you have to remember is to include your team name and number on the front of the notebook. You can also include Facebook, Twitter, and you also need to have the team name and number on the side of the notebook. Next, you need to include a summary of your team and its activities over the course of the season. You should also include highlights of the team season and a list of entries of interest that you want the judges to look at in particular. The rest of the notebook is divided into sections. The first is the team section. In our notebook, here we include biographies of each of our team members, including their name, their grade, how long they've been in FTC, their favorite color, their favorite food, things like that. We also write down who are our captains and who are our newer members. In this section, you should also include information about your team's outreach activities. Our team does this with milestones, a format unique to our team. In each milestone, we include the purpose of each project, the process of completing each project, and what we ended up with. We also include pictures and other relevant materials. In addition to outreach, we also include milestones about building, computer-aided design, and programming. Following the team section is the engineering section. In addition to our building, programming, and CAD milestones, we also include our daily log. Each daily entry should include everything that happens at a meeting, including its date and time, who was present, and what each team member did. These entries should be very detailed and specific about what you did and how you did it, including any problems you faced and how you fixed them. As a formality, you should also have black boxes on any white space. As much as possible, you should also include pictures of your team members doing these activities. It's also useful to include other materials you produce at your meetings, including programs and hand drawings. The last section of the notebook should be one of three things, a business plan, a strategic plan, or a sustainability plan. Our business plan is laid out by a budget proposal we presented to our school at the beginning of the season. That's everything. Thank you for watching and feel free to contact us if you have any questions.